Hello everyone and welcome to Draytech Australia and New Zealand. In this video, I will show you the steps on how to configure the Viga 2710NE router so that it can be used as an access point. We will use a Viga 2925 router for the internet connection. The Viga 2710NE access point will be connected to the main router by LAN cable. So let's begin. First, connect a computer or laptop to the Viga 2710NE. Then click on LAN and then General Setup. Change the LAN IP address of the Viga 2710NE to be different to the one of the main router. For example, if the Viga 2925 LAN IP is set to 192.168.1.1, then change the Viga 2710NE LAN IP to 192.168.1.10. Next, disable the DHCP server by clicking Disable Server. Then go to Wireless LAN, then General Setup. To set up the Wi-Fi SSID, enable the Wireless LAN and enter an SSID. We will enter the SSID test. Click on OK to save the settings. Now go to Wireless LAN security settings menu and select the security mode. We will select WPA2 slash PSK. Now enter the pre-shared key and click OK to save the settings. Optional settings that can be made are in wireless LAN then advanced setting menu. Additionally, WMM settings can be adjusted in the wireless LAN then WMM configuration menu to customize the wireless settings to suit the type of data being transmitted over the Wi-Fi. Now connect the LAN port of the Viga 2710NE to the LAN port of the internet router you are using. The configuration is now completed and we now have Wi-Fi access to our network. And that's it, it's as simple as that. On our laptop, we connect to the SSID and should get access to the internet over Wi-Fi. Congratulations! You have now successfully configured the Viga 2710NE to work as an access point. For more information, please go to our website www.draytech.com.au or you can send us an email to sales at tradetech.com.au. Thank you for watching.